Welcome to the course of Wind Energy. I'm Xiaoli Gu Lashian. This is a following up version of the course of the same name from the Technical University of Denmark, the Department of Wind and Energy Systems. We hope to attract and engage more people into wind energy for a better future of the planet through this course. We hope when you complete the course, you will be able to Describe briefly the multidisciplinary system of wind energy. To explain the basic principles, state of the art of each subject you've learned. To apply the knowledge in practice and be even more interested in wind energy. It will be excellent if you continue your journey with wind energy and make good use of it after the course. I'll give you a brief overview of the collection of lectures here. The development of wind energy has never been so fast. Accordingly, our knowledge, theories, tools and data have been going through significant progresses. The course subjects and content here align with our previous version with major updates. We have altogether 16 lectures prepared and they cover four themes wind energy systems, wind turbine design, materials and components, and power and energy systems. The first theme is about the broad system of wind energy. We have prepared four lectures covering four important aspects. The first one is wind energy economics, including value creation and matrix. The second lecture provides an introduction to wind atlases, including methods and data for wind resources and siting conditions. And that is followed by the lecture on wind farm design and optimization. And the last lecture is forecasting of wind power. Wind turbine design is an important theme for wind energy. We have two lectures prepared. The first one introduces one-dimensional momentum theory and the best limit for maximum power production. And the second lecture introduces different methods and concepts related to wind turbine design for harvesting wind energy. Measurements of winds are relevant across several themes. Here we have prepared three lectures for the previous two themes. The first lecture introduces why we measure wind and how we measure wind. The second lecture is about remote sensing for wind energy, including basic principles and some applications. This is followed by the third lecture, introducing load measurements on wind turbines. For wind energy development, we need to address materials and components. For this theme, we have prepared five lectures the first one is composite materials for wind energy. The second and third are fatigue phenomena and fatigue light prediction. And the fourth and the fifth are blade testing and modeling and blade design and manufacturing. When we talk about wind energy, eventually we want an efficient power and energy system. Here for this thing, we have two lectures. With the first one, an introduction to high voltage direct current, and the second one on the influence of fluctuating wind speeds on system frequency and frequency control. You can already have an overview of the content of each lecture from the course website. While you're following the course, we strongly recommend that you use the discussion volumes. Here you can post comments and questions and exchange thoughts with your fellow course participants. From the course website, you can also find relevant information about the teachers. Here are all teachers you will meet. We're scientists teaching wind and energy systems. We look forward to this journey with you and hope you enjoy the course.